Hello, everyone. Oh my goodness, I look humongo from this angle. Okay, that's a little bit better, I guess. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Melody and I make faith-based content here on YouTube. And the title of this video is not clickbait. Let's hop into it. I am going to be taking a break from YouTube. Now normally when I take these breaks from YouTube, which I am not a stranger to taking a break, which I'm sure if you guys have been around here for a while, you know, I normally don't really explain myself beforehand or give you guys a heads up, but this time I really wanted to just bring you guys into the loop, I guess, or like really lift the veil, share what's going on, share my heart behind taking this break and also at the end of this video i do have a giveaway just to say thank you to you guys for an amazing year on youtube and to celebrate christmas with you all as well so let's just go ahead and hop right into it so first things first water as you guys know we are having our first child a baby girl and she's due at the end of january as things have been like we've slowly been approaching the new year been approaching my due date i'm trying to get more things together i'm sitting in my rocking chair we have my breastfeeding cart which is not set up quite yet we put together her bassinet we have her dresser i did my first load of baby laundry and i'm like learning how to fold all her little onesies and newborn thingies so it's been really, really exciting to like prepare to welcome in to this world our first child. And I feel like the way that I've been trying to balance YouTube, working full time, moving into this house, navigating our first year of marriage, which in and of itself is a challenge. Like marriage is challenging. Being pregnant while you're going through your first year of marriage adds to that challenge as well. So there's so many things that we've been navigating and I feel like a lot of times I'm just going through the motions. This is like, I just gotta get this next thing done, gotta get this next thing done and I'm not taking time to really acknowledge all of the changes that I'm experiencing not just physically like I'm literally growing a child I am gaining weight every single week <laughs> like my body has changed so much and on top of the physical changes there's emotional changes there's mental changes there's spiritual changes like we're all as in we like my husband and I we're navigating all of this as <coughs> newlyweds <laughs> and first time parents and we don't have our immediate family in the same state as us either so to be honest it's just been a lot and i have been feeling a bit lost on youtube to be completely honest in regards to my content like how much to share i've, I've never seen myself like I don't see my channel becoming like a family vlogging channel, but as so many different things have been happening in my personal life, it has been easy to share that with you guys. But I also still feel very passionate about making um, faith-based content, like sitting down and talking to you guys about the Bible and God and my relationship with him and trying to figure out how to marry the two. And that's definitely been something I've been navigating and feeling, to be honest, a little bit confused about some weeks i feel like i i have a vision for it and other weeks i feel like i don't and i feel like it's taking some time to step back and really get a plan and a vision for my channel and really make sure that i'm in alignment with what the lord wants me to create here on youtube it's going to be really really helpful for me and it will allow me to just focus on that not the numbers not how well the videos are doing because that can be very discouraging when you are seeing your videos not do well which i have been experiencing recently and it has been discouraging and um and it's not like uh, it's your fault or anything like that it's i feel like there's just changes going on in my channel and we're all trying to navigate it as in my audience and myself so by taking a break i'm gonna be able to have time i think i need space in my day i need to give myself margin to really create sustainable like flows for how i can do everything that i want to do and do everything that i feel like god is calling me to do 
So luckily once I do go on maternity leave at my job, I will have five months off, which is gonna be amazing. And so that'll give me the opportunity to really focus on the baby, focus on YouTube, excuse me, focus on the other areas that I have passion in like my Facebook ministry group. I have been wanting to launch a shop for my Facebook ministry group forever. I've been wanting to launch a new devotional forever. Like there's just so many things that I wanna do, but I just don't have enough time in the day at all. And I also wanna be a good sister, friend, mother. <clears throat> well, I guess, well yeah, mother. So, long story short, I plan to take at least a month off of YouTube from creating new content, but that or posting new content, but that doesn't necessarily mean I'm not gonna be filming in the meantime. I will be filming. These videos will just go up after the fact, after I take this break. And this time will really allow me to just like get organized, have a plan, create some margin for myself, find some rhythms, how to create sustainability within my life so I don't feel like I'm just like doggy paddling day in and day out and um, really just focus on the things that are important because I feel like in this age of social media, especially as I kind of step in more into being like a full-time YouTuber, it is gonna be really important for me to make sure that I am not living my life for my channel, but I want my channel to be something that I'm able to just like share aspects of my life on, but I don't ever wanna be in that position where I'm doing things in my real life that are just for content. Like that makes me feel, the thought of that makes me feel so uncomfortable. And I feel like that's kind of what leads to burnout and oh, it's just hard, <laughs> honestly. It seems amazing to be able to um, do something like this full time, but there's also definitely challenges that come along with it as well. So with all that being said, um, I'll be seeing you guys in about a month. That's what's going on. That's why I'm gonna be taking a break. And in this meantime as well, I'm gonna be still posting on Instagram. I still want to um, send out my monthly newsletter and kind of just, again, like get systems in place where I'm consistent with these things because I feel like I have so many ideas, but I'm not consistent with it because there's just so many moving parts going on in my life, so yes. So still Instagram still um the newsletter so if you guys aren't following my instagram be sure to and if you guys aren't signed up for the monthly newsletter be sure to i'll be sending that out before the new year the december one and um i'm also going to be finally looking for help i want to hire a local personal assistant here in atlanta so if you guys are interested definitely reach out to me in my email address below um that would be awesome i'm going to be talking about this in the newsletter as well as on instagram as well Wow, I just said as well twice. Pregnancy brain. So that is that. Now giveaway time. So this is just for me to honor you guys and to say thank you for an amazing year and to celebrate Christmas with you. So the rules to enter the giveaway are very, very easy. And the winners, we're gonna have two winners and you can enter, it can be either a US person or international. And I wanna give away two $100 Amazon gift cards. And all you have to do to enter is to follow me here on, or subscribe to me here on YouTube, follow me on Instagram, make sure that you are signed up for my newsletter. The link will be in the description box below. And just leave a comment saying what your word for 2022 is. I have not had a moment to sit down and pick out my word yet, but I would love to hear your guys' words and why you chose it and get some inspiration as I start praying about what the Lord has for me and my word for 2020. So I will have all that, the rules and everything like that listed in the description box. That is just my thank you to you guys. I really, really love and appreciate you all. And I think all the opportunities that have come to me this year, it wouldn't be possible without you guys. And so I'm just super grateful for this platform, super grateful that God has trusted me with this platform and I really want to steward it well. And I feel like by taking this break, it'll allow me to do just that, like to be organized, to, to honor you guys with great content, to be thoughtful, to just show up the way that I know God's calling me to show up on here and to be proud of myself and the content that I create. And again, to just make sure that everything I create really is for 
his glory. Because at the end of the day, that's why I have this channel. You know what I mean? Like, it is only God. Only God. And I don't want to ever get away from that or forget that. Okay. So, love you all. I will see you in about a month. And um, I pray everyone is healthy, staying healthy this holiday season. And Merry Christmas. I love you. I keep saying that. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys soon. Peace.